Hello ladies and jelly beans, me only here of Ace Games TV. Now today I was going to put out the first episode of my brand new series for Final Fantasy Lightning Returns, however YouTube decided to sign me out overnight, which means that nevertheless I will make a video today and I will get one out to you. So I decided to check out Titanfall for this video. Uh, this is a game currently in closed beta, the open beta should be in the next week or so. Uh, it has no NDA on it so I can share my thoughts, opinions and indeed footage of it. I'm not going to do the training level, you have to do a, a, an arbitrary uh, sort of training level to, to actually gain access to the multiplayer side um, when you actually play the beta, but it's not really that fun. So we're going to get straight into the action momentarily. But a little bit of information about this. This game is being made by Respawn Entertainment, which funnily is an American video game development studio, which is actually founded by Jason West and Vince Zampella. Now, you may not recognize those names for many good reasons, um, or, you know, you might recognize them, but they were formerly responsible for the development of Call of Duty back at Infinity Ward when that was still a thing. So uh, these guys know what they're talking about. This is very much Call of Duty with mechs. Yes, it's a mech game. It's very fast paced, a lot more fast paced than Call of Duty. Um, there is sniping and you know slow down stuff here and there, but most of the time it's giant mechs firing lots of rockets and salvos and people firing rocket launchers at you. But we'll uh, we'll show you that momentarily. So I'm going to show you now the footage of my first impressions, and we're going to share some uh, information and show you some footage of what the game is like, and you can judge whether or not you want to go and pre-order this game. The reminder that this is published by EA, so this might put a lot of people off using the Origin service. It's not as bad as it used to be, but uh, it's still rather annoying nonetheless. So let's get straight into it, shall we? Oh, alright then. We have a choice between Rifleman and Assassin here. Um, the screen is glitching out a little bit. We're going to go for... Okay, we'll do. So this is pretty much uh, deathmatch. Um, the only mode that's enabled in the beta at the moment. I'm having a bit of FPS issues here and there. Hopefully that doesn't come through on a recording. This is a really overpowered weapon that I'm going to be using first, which um, isn't this one. I'm going to look. Oh my god. Now I'm a bit of a noob. I don't really play games like Call of Duty. This one here. This smart pistol locks onto targets uh, and multiple targets, and then you can press the left trigger and it will fire um, when it locks on, that is. Come on, lock. There we go. We got our first kill. Um, I believe that was a player. Yay! Um, as bad as me, no doubt. Wow. Okay. <laughs> yeah, this gun is pretty overpowered for the first gun you use. It locks on. Not sure that this will be something that people... Um, People will want to be this overpowered in the final game. Um, you know, locking onto a target and just pressing left trigger is a bit overpowered. Let's chase this guy. Come on. Have a grenade. Oh, I can lock onto the grenade. Very cool. Alright. Clear. Let's let's try and find someone. Like I say, it's very action-based. Uh, ooh. Get fucked, bitch. Okay. <laughs> let's go through here. Now... Right, so that message there, 60 seconds until I can get my Titan. Now, the Titan, which you'll see momentarily, is a giant mech that I can actually pilot around this map and kill people with, which is fantastic, and that's what we want to play the game for. Um, I'm trying to flank them here. This might work. Oh, God, this will definitely work. Now, of course, not all of these uh, NPCs here, well, not all of these people are players. Some of them are our NPCs. Um, oh, here we go. So we press V now. Um, you can increase the speed of which you can access your Titan by getting kills. We get thrown in here. And now it's time to kick some ass. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Oh, my God. What? Why am I nearly dead? Oh, that was an enemy Titan next to me. <laughs> So there's a shield ability, um, if someone fires bullets at you at rockets, you can stop them, Matrix style, midair, and then throw them back at them, which is particularly awesome. Um, like this. I love that move, that is amazing. So it's, it's a kind of a combo between shielding with the left trigger, 
Oh, I'm gonna reject. I do have an anti-Titan weapon though, which I'm gonna use. I'm not gonna take that flying down or flying through the air. Is this maybe die? I'm, I'm gonna die horribly to this. Oh no! Yeah. <laughs> He's got there's, so there's various perks you can get. That was nuclear ejection. So when he ejects, it actually causes the core of the Titan to explode with a massive nuclear warhead. Um, which kills anybody nearby, so unfortunately that was me. Oh, that guy got owned. See, this weapon is very overpowered. I'm just, I don't know, I'm using this because I don't really have um, anything else unlocked. And I've chosen a class that only seems to have this. So there's a friendly titan shooting point blank at these poor people. Um, we're still not going to win. Oh, level 2. Oh yeah. So there is levels, like I say, it's very Call of Duty-esque. To someone who's played Call of Duty before, that guy is like looking. Wow, he's he was right there, and I didn't see him. So it's very Call of Duty. Yes, sorry. Um, so there's a leveling system. Currently, the max is 14. Like I said in the intro. Um, what's in here? There was a guy in here. My Titans ready. Oh God, why did I throw a grenade at myself? That was not wise. So is <laughs> that guy got destroyed? I don't know how he survived so long. There isn't actually uh, damage to the environments. It looks like there is there, but um, it it's, doesn't have that sort of technology. What was I saying? Yes, it's very much like Call of Duty in nearly every respect, simply because uh, the people who make it. However, it's a lot more action-paced, as you can see. You can't just stay in one place and hope to survive. Um, you can't really camp very easily in this. Well, you can, I guess, but you know, there's snipers, there's crazy people. Like that Titan fall there, you can actually kill people with your Titan if you press V where they land. I was trying to do it to this other mech, but it didn't work. That guy got owned. I got an assist for that, I, I think. I don't think I took it down. Oh god, there's another one. Oh god. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting owned here. Got to eject. Right. Got the old uh, smart gun out. See if we can take this guy down first. No. Oh god. Oh my god. That was a 40 millimeter cannon in the face. <laughs> so this is like the familiar kill cams and things. The uh, the rounds don't take too long. It's all action paced stuff. You know, 15 to 20 minutes around. Um, I can't actually remember what it is. It's not really long on attrition. There are other game modes that they're planning. You know, capture the flag and bomb the base and all that stuff. Um, but they're not currently in the beta. You can only do attrition, which is essentially team deathmatch. That guy got owned. Jesus Christ. Um, there are different classes, like I say. There's different loadouts. You can customize your loadout. You can customize your Titan to your own special needs. Oh my god, there's one there. That is one scary looking Titan. Holy shit. Let's see if we can take him down. Does he know I'm here? Yes, he knows I'm here. Oh god. Maybe I can. No. No. Come on. Oh, yes! I has got away from him. Oh my god, but there's like four. There's like four enemy titans. I need to get some kills now. Uh, oh, we're completely overwhelmed. We're definitely not going to win this one. But look at the, the scores down there. They're, I'd like to say they're, they're near, but then. Well, I guess they are, but. Um, it's actually quite a close match. I suck bad, though. This is literally my first time playing this. Um, but I have actually seen people play it. Angry Joe did a really good live stream of this, and that's partly what made me want to get in the beta. Oh, let's get my Titan down. It's a bit of a war zone. Oh, Jesus. Oh my god, did you see that? I died, but my Titan landed on the other Titan, and I'm not sure how that one didn't explode. Oh, I got run over. Oh, okay. Right. So my Titan should st oh, Go away. This guy's trying to rocket launder everything right in our uh, area. Right, so my Titan should still be there. Now, as you can see, my Titan is still alive, and it ha it's uh, actually in automatic mode. If you press V when the Titan's already down, you can make it follow you, you can make it defend points, or you can just leave it to its own devices. Damn. So once you get defeated, uh, at least in attrition... Oh wow, look at the snipe! Jesus Christ! I was just there talking to you guys, and this guy just owns me. That's probably the only kill he's got. 
because the amount of people moving this is impossible uh, to aim at. So you can run up walls, there's wall jumping, yeah, if you double tap space, you jump and then you, you uh, use your jetpack on the back. Uh, pretty much familiar to any other sort of COD-like game. So as you can see, once you lose, you have to try and evac. If you win, you don't have to evac. Um, how the hell am I supposed to get up there? Is there a ladder or something? But you're supposed to get to the dropship and get aboard. Um, the enemy team gets extra bonus points for taking out the dropship, uh, especially if you're on it. Oh, come on. Right, how do I get up there? I can't wall run up there. Um, shooting it doesn't help. Oh, it's gone. Oh, this could be bad. Uh, run away. Run away. Oh. So the end of the match there. I didn't do too badly. Uh, seven deaths, seven kills. That's, uh, I, I attributed nothing there. But then again, my, the rest of my team was pants. Look at their enemy team, though. They were all 14s. There we go. So uh, those guys have been playing for a while. As you can see, I've unlocked some perks. There's experience. Um, what have I unlocked? Oh, my God. A level and a half. That was, that was pretty cool. So what we got? We got um, the new pilot loadout for CQB. Not sure what that is. It's probably got extra tools. As you can see, this is very familiar to COD. It's very addictive. A lot of people have said how addictive this is. Uh, so there it is. We've got the assassin. We've got the rifleman, which is the carbine, which is something I should have chose, but I went with the insta-kill pistol because I'm a noob. But this is a, a lot of fun. This is for a beta, um, very polished. There's a few graphical glitches. I'm using um, Radeon 6950s in SLI. I don't know. It, it's not optimized yet. Go try it out if you can. Open beta is next week. But I'm, I'm certainly enjoying it. It's a lot of fun on the sidelines. Uh, if you want to see more videos from this, leave a like and a comment below of what you want to see. And I'll try and do it. Thanks for watching my video. And I'll see you next time.